The Betacast podcast is filmed in front of a live studio audience. So I guess we start hey, now. Hey, yes, we start. All right. This is how we start. Okay, welcome to the Betacast podcast again. Yes. Now, if if anyone here is wondering, why are you doing this? <laughs> what is your problem? <laughs> I forgot I was even subscribed to you, and you'd be right. <laughs> no one remembers that they're subscribed to me, but the reason we're doing this is because um, mainly a few things. Like I, I want a little, uh, just an outlet to be able to say things that I, that I want to say, um, like about the the world currently. Um, that um, my channel's dead, so I would like to have something to do um, that doesn't take as much effort. And um, also, I just have these kinds of conversations with uh, with Flipyard here all the time. And it's crazy. It's it's pretty wacky. So then I came with the ingenious idea. Hey, this should be a podcast. No, you didn't. <laughs> no, you did not. <laughs> you lying person. <laughs> um, no, but we have a we have a great list of topics here. We're just gonna talk about them. You know, very boring, very overdone, very. Um, so so just <laughs> so just sit <laughs> sit back, relax. <laughs> And wonder why you're still subscribed to this channel. Yes. Um, welcome to the Betacast. Um, if you're wondering about any background noise, it's because um, I have some construction, not construction, but some gardening work going on outside. And also because of my um, autistic cousin who's in the background <laughs> here and likes making funny screams. Do a funny Just scream. For the- See? There, there he is. That, that, Do another one. Do another one. Jesus. Oh! Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Great. So Just subscri- for the record, I subscribe to I Master Brick Studios. That's his, uh, <laughs> B- Bugs Bunny now. I think that's what his channel is called. He calls his okay. channel Just Bugs Bunny. Sonny. Just for Sonny. Sonny. Just for the you. record, I couldn't. I couldn't hear him like at all oh, really? until you told him to scream. Until you told him to scream. Oh no! You didn't say anything. No, but you, I couldn't even hear like the noise. No, like, uh, no, any anything at all until you were like, "Hey, scream!" And I was like, "Yeah, I know he wasn't." He was pure moan any of noise. passion. Okay, anyways, this is already a complete disaster. <laughs> <laughs> what were we talking about? Fortnite. Let's talk about Fortnite. <laughs> Fortnite. Um. <laughs> all right. So let's you talk have more about to say about this Fortnite. than I do. Go ahead. Yes. So season five is coming along. For anyone who cares. Um. I, I don't know if anyone cares. So but, the, the um, theme of this time is it's real life now. <laughs> Fortnite in real life. I don't get it. <laughs> I don't get it. But it's apparently... Just for the record, I don't either. The um, new part in the map is literally California. Oh, yeah, I've heard from Jake that the new part... No, it's like a bunch of shit from the world. It's just like in that map for some reason and there's like time rifts next to it and it's like a way it's, to transport I yourself i don't um, understand well well at least you have to give epic games some credit for giving enough of a shit to like add stuff like this to the game you know to make it interesting i mean you, we already we already know how over saturated and dead the battle royale genre is at least they're spicing it up a bit i can i can you know give them credit for here's that here's the thing though like i've said this multiple times but uh, the reason I wanted to talk about this on on this podcast is because um I just I don't understand why they don't why don't they just add another map just add yeah. add another map and like add basic things like you know matchmaking and and 1v1 battles without having to like make it your yourself on a on a whatchamacallit, a, a playground thing. Just, like, have a, a, you know, smaller map. Have, like, <coughs> actual game modes. A smaller map? Yes, have another smaller map that is meant for 1v1 duels. I feel like... 
I don't know. Well, I mean, it, it, but it, I mean, that's why they, they made playgrounds because like you're just because that's literally what playgrounds is, and you can just no, but like then, you like, have to you have to organize <laughs> it yourself, like you know what I'm saying, like and then you have to like add people and stuff. It's like just. I want the ability to go into, like, a matchmaking thing and, like, have, have like, a four team, four people in a team versus four people in a team, and it's just a, I don't see a team deathmatch. What's wrong with that? Well, because then it's, because cause then it wouldn't be Fortnite Battle Royale. Where? Well, that's a mode at one point. Like, it's, like, a 50 v 50 thing, but it's, like... Are you talking about 50 v 50? Are you going to say that that's team deathmatch? I mean, it counts. Uh, pretty and much. How does that count? How does, what do you that, mean? Count how does under, that count? It's 50 people versus 50 people. Yeah. And there's there's no lives. There's no respawns. I don't see... It's so us. You're, you're making a... a it's still the battle royale mode. It's the battle royale mode, but it's like multiple... Well, it's like 50 on, people versus 50 people. Well, they're working to an on extent, it's deathmatch. And uh, the they other argument that he likes to make, he likes Fortnite a lot, by the way. Um, <laughs> I like how I like how your cousin is is procedurally uh, becoming part of the podcast. Yeah. So, uh, do you want to just be part of the podcast now? Because <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm it's like should we should we should we add uh, featuring Sebas just featuring Master Fe- Brick Studios? It's like Master the first, Rick. the first, <laughs> featuring the first Bugs guess. Bunny, <laughs> or f- <coughs> featuring Flipyard. <laughs> Actually, I'm a one time. I'm yeah. a guest for every episode. <laughs> <laughs> Rebetic as featuring Flipyard every single fucking episode. Oh my god. <laughs> no. Anyways, I'm um, sorry, Sebas. Uh, what, what was I saying? No, is it, there should just be actual modes in the the game. Well, there are there are modes. In no, the game. like it's I'm, just that they keep being changed. What are the modes that don't revolve around the battle royale concept? But it's a battle royale game. It doesn't need to be strictly <clears throat> that. That's what I'm saying. That's why I get so bored. Cause like, it's not bad. It's just. Boring. There's not much yeah, else you can do. And the, and their quote unquote story mode <coughs> is just so bad. <laughs> yeah. It's like but let's be I've honest. It's like I've heard it. I've heard this was like an absolute grind. It's just bad. It's I wouldn't even consider it a story. So like, and that's the only thing they like make you pay for. So it just brings a lot into question and. I don't know. I'm not a huge fan, but uh, it's not the worst thing in the world. Um, no, definitely not. People saying that Fortnite is straight up bad is is they're wrong. That's that that's yeah, that's wrong. Um, no, because it's actually I don't I don't actually understand most of the hate on Fortnite. I get it. I get it because of the fandom, but the game itself. The fandom it's is like, just trash. But I mean, that's not a no. Yeah, the fandom is argument. fucking awful. But like, that's not an like, argument you should make against like. A game, or yeah, but, yeah, I know, I know, I, I know. But yet again, fandoms do ruin things, and that's that's something yes. I've always had an issue with. It's how fandoms completely ruin things. I know. It's like it's 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 really annoying. Now people, I've seen people all over the place have this like idea that Rick and Morty is just a bad show now. Oh my god! Yeah, it's, oh. it's like no, it's just. People, people overhype it's it too much. Yeah, and then pe- people, people and, and people like it for the wrong reasons. Yeah, and then it's like, oh well, no. Now Rick and Morty is is just a bunch of like intellectual trash. Every, and it's, like the thing is, I I still like Rick and Morty, but every time I see adults Adult Swim just like post any pro- type of promotion thing for Rick and Morty, I just get there's just this thing in the back of my head where I'm like, ugh. Right? Why is it so? Why is it so popular now? It's yeah, like I remember back in season one and two. It's like it's too much. It's too much. But no, I, I think no. the best thing about that show is Justin Roiland because he's just yeah. The sh- show yeah. would not be the same without that guy. He has like so much integrity. So same with uh, same thing with Alex Hirsch, 
and Gravity Falls, yeah. those two guys are like, they're they just make their shows so like personal, you know, like th- there's a lot of personality that's in their shows. Um, Segway, we're talking about the Emmys now. Segway, epic Segway. Oh, <laughs> we're talking oh, about the Emmys. Oh, hey, Speaking of Rick and Morty. <laughs> <laughs> oh my speaking God. of the Emmys, <laughs> <laughs> no, but actually, <laughs> like, that's our segue. Actually, so speaking of, and then um, I, I don't want to talk about Fortnite anymore. Um, what I wanted to say about Fair the enough. Emmys was um, uh, it has to do with Rick and Morty, so that's why I did the epic segue. Thank you, thank you very much. Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> I applaud um, you for that. Good job, good job. Uh, yeah, ten minutes I, in, and this is already just a complete fucking. <laughs> Just clusterfuck. All right. Uh, the Emmys, you were saying. Yes. Um, so, I, I noticed... I noticed, like, there was a weird nomination for the Emmys, and I don't really pay attention to the Emmys too much these days. No, neither do I. I um, forgot they existed. Or ever. Um, <laughs> where's the... <clears throat> where's the thing? It was... Okay. Um, it was... Okay, so Rick and Morty got... It got nominated for the first time, which is fantastic. Oh, yeah? um, I actually don't really know why it's the first time. <laughs> um, but uh, Probably because it's gained th- think, popularity. Think what episode, which of all the episodes is the one that got nominated for Oh, Emmy? for God's sake. Don't Please don't say it's the one I th- I'm thinking of right now. It's Pickle Rick. God Pickle Rick is the one that got no! nominated. Oh, I hate everything. <laughs> I hate the Emmys. Fuck the Emmys. Oh my and, god, okay, why would you do that? Pickle Rick was not a bad episode. But it it's wasn't, like, but... <sighs> it, it's like... It was a there, good episode, but I'm... F- there, uh. If you're gonna say, out of the season three episodes, what is the one that deserves a, n- an award? <laughs> <laughs> Hey Morty! Hey Morty! I turned myself into an Emmy. Hey (laughs) Morty! I turned myself into an Emmy Award. Morty, look at me, Morty! I'm Emmy Rick. Oh my God! And like, I hate my life. I hate. I don't care about the Emmys because they never, they never do anything interesting. It's the same thing with the Oscars. They're like, okay, what should we nominate for like the best shows? The same ones, every (laughs) single year. (laughs) Yeah. Every single year. It's always the same ones, and there's no surprises. It's like, all right, let's nominate the ones that, like, are just these long uh, 44 to an hour minute episodes where it just... What did I even say? Forty mi- 44 minutes to an hour long episodes, and it's just so boring most of the time. <laughs> people are going to be like, people are going to tell me, oh... But but you you haven't seen them, so how can you tell me? It's like you haven't you haven't endured them, so how can you tell me whether it's good or bad? It's like if I watch like the first three or four episodes of a show and I'm just like trying to chug through it, it's like a it's like a <laughs> chore for me. Like <laughs> I don't want to keep going. <laughs> it's just like oh, don't worry, it gets better. It gets better yeah, after the like first. I had- Ten, I had that. It gets out better after the first <laughs> ten hours. You have to endure ten fine hours, like ten mediocre <laughs> hours, and then it gets good. Like what? <laughs> no, I'm. I'm <laughs> That's the I, problem I have with a lot of uh, a lot of shows. Oh, it just was on, like, just on Netflix. Everyone's like telling me, "Dude, watch this, watch this." I mean, the first like three seasons are trash. This is what like, I watched. But like this one is... episode in season four is good. Yeah. Oh my god. I started watching what's oh my god it was like uh, the crown or something <laughs> that's one of the nominees by the way and I watched oh. like the first three episodes I'm like this is so boring <laughs> this is so bo- I don't care <laughs> what's what's the like um, stranger things is one of these nominations and that's one I agree with you know why? Because well, when I started, I haven't seen wa- it, so I wouldn't know. So Stranger Things is fantastic because I started watching, um, I watched the the first episode, and like the first three minutes intrigued me so much that I was like, I'm completely sold on the show, and I want to keep watching it. All right, and then 
I'm okay. I'm not. I don't want to generalize because I know a lot of people are gonna tell me like, dude, you need to watch all these shows before you say anything. Uh, which I don't have to watch all of them, but I do need to see a little bit more. You're right. Right. I'm not gonna argue that Game of Thrones <clears throat> is not a masterpiece because most people say it is. Um, I just haven't seen it yet, so I'm not gonna debate that. I'm not. Um. I'm not going to say that Westworld is bad because I haven't seen that either. And a lot of people tell me it's really great. So I'm not, I'm not going to say that. It's just, it's the same thing with the Oscars where I don't, when I see the Oscars, I'm like, okay, this is not anything out of the ordinary. I don't see anything here that is surprising me at all. And so it's just boring. Yeah. And you just stop caring. Um... But I, and I think like the other thing that just like makes me so not interested is the fact that they're like, okay, so this new show Rick and Morty is getting a lot of attention, um, but but when it was it's at like, its peak, it's like- when it was at its peak, it wasn't like it didn't have as much attention as it does now. So let's just, it, when it wasn't like, okay, I don't know how to say. It. So it's like when. It was at its peak. It had the best episodes, but it didn't have as much attention. But now it does. <coughs> so let's like, it's like the the let's uh, nominate the, the most popular yet not as good episode for for an Emmy. <laughs> it's like it's like, <clears throat> it's like if um the, the, they weren't sure what episode to pick. And they just didn't care enough. So they just put a poll on like straw poll. Uh, like, should we actually care and look for good episodes? <laughs> or it's just like, and then like the second option is Pickle Rick. And like, it's 100% and on you know Pickle what? Rick. You know what like grinds my gears even more? What? <clears throat> oh my god. I'm actually really mad about this one. Um... Bojack Horseman was not nominated. Oh! Yeah. Bojack Horseman was not <laughs> nominated and has never been nominated. Which because just, it's like not... Because, but it's, it's, it's like not, the show isn't even... Popular. The show isn't... Yeah. But it's the like, show isn't no, popular. no, no. To any... Yeah, like, why? <sighs> I'm, I'm, okay, like, seriously. I recently rewatched the the whole show. And, like, I'm not fucking exaggerating when I say this. The end of season four actually made me tear up a bit. It's... Like, I know. It, it's, it like, didn't, such a It didn't even show. make me... Like... It's not even like, and that's just the second time. It's like fucking hell, man. Yeah. Why, why? If, if anyone's listening to this and they haven't uh, watched Boja- seen Bojack Horseman, please do because it's a masterpiece. Yeah, it's it's really good, really, 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 really good. I'm. It, it makes me so sad that not enough people watch it or acknowledge it. Yeah. Or what's where are the other um, where are the other animated? nominees i didn't see them <clears throat> let me just look them up i saw i saw that honest trailers was nominated for something and hold on i need to see this where is uh wow we're completely unprepared um <laughs> yeah where's, where's the material all right anyways <laughs> i can't see but I'm, I'm, again, I'm very happy for Rick and Morty that they finally got their nomination. I think that's fantastic. Um, weird episode to nominate them for. <laughs> yeah. It's a very strange one. Yep. Um, <laughs> it's just, uh, yeah, it's a little weird. But anyways, um, I'm kind of tired of talking about the Emmys because I don't care that much. <laughs> um... <laughs> What was the other thing? We like the Oscars. The Oscars annoyed me so much last year. Oh god, I, I never cared about the Oscars. Oh no. my god, I watched the Oscars. <clears throat> I was just like, this is just—it's so predictable. Yeah, goes to moonlight. Um, but it's like I never expect anything different from the Oscars anymore because it's just like, okay, what's What's the most like Oscar bait movie that we can that we can <laughs> nominate this year? Let's go for that, the like post. everyone that everyone expected. Yes, the one that everyone expects. 
How about an actually really great... Oh, oh my god, this... This is a funny thing, because... The Oscars recently has made some strange choices with, uh... With the animation department. They're like, okay... So, let's nominate... Uh, let's forget about the Lego Batman movie. That movie was not interesting or special in any way, and it, it wasn't, uh, unique in its own way whatsoever. Um... It was not a special movie at all. Let's nominate <clears throat> the goddamn Boss Baby for an Oscar. <laughs> no. For an oh, Oscar. God. I think that's just the same case as the Emmys, though. The oh, Boss my Baby God. Got a lot more popular than fucking the Batman movie. God, why, though? Jesus Christ. <laughs> that's that's tragic. Uh, uh, and, if, of course, none of them stood a chance to Coco, so it doesn't even matter, because yeah. they always nominate the... Uh, they, the Pixar movie always wins. Uh, it doesn't matter if another one is better. And I'm not saying Coco wasn't good, because Coco was great. Coco was fantastic. Um, but, I, what was it? There was one year... Actually, I don't know. I'm I'm probably talking out of my ass. I think there was a... Um, there was a year... <laughs> where, where, like, Monsters University was nominated or something. And then... Actually, I actually have no idea what I'm talking about. Never mind. No, what was another? <laughs> oh, okay. What was another <clears throat> snub though? It was the Lego Movie, again with yeah. the Lego stuff. They, uh, they didn't acknowledge the Lego Movie, which most people would disagree with. Um, yeah. <laughs> and there was no Pixar movie that year, so I actually don't even remember what one. But it was like, I don't even, dude. I don't even pay attention to the fucking Oscars oh, at all. Man. There's, it's just Why a bunch of old it, like, guys. I don't understand. I don't. Un- yeah, it's like, um, <laughs> what movie was popular enough so we can make it more popular by giving it an Oscar? That I remember. Oh my God, it was so ridiculous at the Oscars. Like with with uh, Jimmy Kimmel, they were there, and uh, <laughs> it was so ridiculous. Oh my God, they started like showing clips of like. Just the most, um, some of the most, like, classic movies of all time. And since it was, <clears throat> and since the Oscars were happening in February, right after Black Panther came out, they're like, let's just show Black Panther as one of the most classic movies of all time. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, they had a montage. <laughs> and they're like, let's put Black fucking Panther in there. <laughs> <laughs> But you just love the movie industry. I love the movie industry. I love the movie industry. I love it. <laughs> God. Oh my God. Let's talk about something else. <laughs> you want us to talk about Tanacon because you have a lot to say about that, don't you? Yeah. Yeah, that was a funny meme. <laughs> <laughs> so I went to VidCon this year and I just had a great time. I don't know what I should talk about first. VidCon I'm totally or not, Tanacon. And by the way, I'm, I'm really happy for you. You got to see all these amazing people. I'm totally not bitter and uh, jealous that you got to meet these people. <laughs> and I probably will never be able to come in any form of contact with them in my life. Hey, so it's all right. You. It's all right. <laughs> Please I subscribe think, to my channel. I think you should plan a trip here, <laughs> genuinely. And plan it is specifically around VidCon so you can see these I people. Don't, I'm really not sure whether if, if we can do that because... You live quite literally, on for me, on the other side of the globe. It's like, all right, it's gonna I, be f- I wicked think you expensive. Should do this. I think you should do this, cause like, um, <clears throat> I think that you should, you should come to like Anaheim while VidCon is going on, uh, next year. Or some some of the, one of these years, I don't even care. Just come. Yeah, but that's still not. That's not gonna make it much cheaper. It's not. I'm not saying it's gonna be cheap, but plan your one trip here. Yeah. Like make it your big trip. You know. The big trip. Yes, and the big... uh, and maybe I could get Emmett to come too, so you could see the him. The big travel. Uh, yeah. And so not only will you come and get to see us, uh, but you'll get to. You get to see all these creators. Um, yeah. And then we could go to Disneyland. 
Which I, I don't. That sounds that sounds like a wicked good. Which idea. I don't. Have you gone to Disneyland in your life? No, no, never. Uh, there you go. There wait, you go. wait, be... wait, 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 wait. Hold on. No, I have, but that's Disney World, right? Well, I mean, um, what, I, what, what the what's the one? What's opinion, the one? I think uh, the... I think Disneyland's better. Wait, hold on. I'm just I'm kind of like trying to process. What? Okay, no, I no, I did. I actually have been to uh, Disneyland in Paris. Oh, but that one's gay. Yeah, okay, but, you know... I... I yeah, cool. That one's cool. gay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> What's the one? It's, but um, enough about us, enough about us. The people who are listening to this don't care, Santi. They don't care about us as individuals. We just have to produce funny content 24-7. But what Otherwise, were, uh, should I talk about, like, my interactions with some of these people? Oh, uh, sure, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's a bit, um, that's a bit into the I mean, relevance. I mean, surprisingly, thing. since I came by myself this time, I kind of wanted <clears> to come <throat> with a friend, but, uh, you know, none of them could have made it. So I, I get, went by myself. I was a little scared. And uh, surprisingly, I made a lot of friends. A lot but of last time you went, you, last time you went alone too, right? No, I went with my dad. Oh, yeah. Um, and he he was gonna come again, but he was like, you know what? I didn't <laughs> I didn't really understand anything that was going on. <laughs> so, so I don't care. So so you know. <laughs> and I I don't blame him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Beticle TV. You have to go alone. Um, but I'm yeah, sure with I mean, your status, you'll, you'll make it out it was, just fine. I think it was good that I went alone because, um, because it was, it was a really great experience. I got to meet a lot of people. Uh, I got to meet a guy called Vinny, who's, uh, I'm going to put his, his link in the description for Twitter. Uh, he makes like, he, he makes Vinny. those rap battle videos, um, but uh but he's he's like he's one of those people who's like kind of tired of making one kind of content and he got like popular off that stuff and oh. he, he hates it because <laughs> his most popular video like t- kind of just how it was for you um his most popular video was like a rap battle between like some creepy pastas and he hates oh. it oh uh um, poor man but uh, unfortunately, that's what he got popular for, and so he had to keep making rap battles to stay relevant. Because um, anything else he made was just didn't get any traction. That um, is, it's damn. awful. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, he seemed like a nice guy. We share a mutual interest in Siva Gunner, which is fantastic. Oh Christ! I got to, I finally got to meet someone in the flesh. <laughs> who has as who has much, the same who has the same he, he sick actually disability does as you. It's disability, man. F- fuck off, all right. <laughs> <laughs> you can fuck right off. <laughs> no, he works for one of those um channels like uh I, I forget what it's called. It's like Nova Sun or something. It's like one of those channels that uh do the same thing. But he's like one of the people who who does stuff for that, and uh, he told me I should be part of it. <gasps> That's insane, dude. Which is is pretty funny, Lamal. <laughs> uh, no, I can hear it right in your right in your voice. You're ecstatic about it. He's a he's a cool guy. I really <clears throat> I really enjoy. It. And he had a token black guy with him, which was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> a what? Uh, he had, he a, had token, a token. He had a token black. <laughs> Um, what? No, but actually, I'm gonna... <laughs> no, 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 um, if you guys are listening, you guys were pretty great during VidCon, thanks for, uh, and if you ever wanna, like, talk on Discord, you can, man, and you can talk to this beautiful, uh, Norwegian boy right here. I, uh, that is false information, actually, I'm gonna have Anyways, to clear this up. um... <laughs> <laughs> um, who else did I? I got to meet um, Chris Wrightgun, who's a very nice fellow, and he um, he agreed to make a be in a video that you will you guys will eventually see in the future. Well, that that I did not know about. Um, uh, what else? He 
I, I met Bunty King uh, again. He I met him last year and he was pretty awesome. Uh, he was with Good me, Lush, which unfortunately he was not with again. Um, oh, that is. I'm Alex. Didn't come shame. again, which I got a little sad about. Um, who, who else? Um, but yeah, Bunty's such a great guy. He also agreed to be in the video. I got to meet Reactor, which is very um, Who's unexpected. That Reactor? You have to see the Monkey Jones video about him because he was. He's crazy, but he he um he agreed to be in the video. A lot of people agreed to be in the video, um, which was great. I really appreciated that. So yeah, you'll you'll get to see that. I got to meet a fantastic person named Grace Motley, who I'm pretty sure is listening to this right now. Uh, uh thanks for thanks for hanging around with me, Grace. Uh, <laughs> you guys can check out her videos. She does like. 10 second long videos and they somehow get thousands of views which is you know it's not it doesn't make me feel like absolute shit you know you know what I'm saying <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> yeah um <laughs> I love how depressing like half of this is <laughs> it's like you meet people who don't who hate their content you know people who have dying channels <laughs> Um, what are you talking about? <laughs> um, our channels aren't we'll dying. On. No, they're not dying. They're as, as, live, as alive as ever. That's why I haven't made anything in, uh... I'm actually well, starting... As of, I'm, as, of as of recording the podcast, I haven't made anything in nine months. I'm starting to get pretty lightheaded right now. Really? Really? Yeah. We're not even halfway. Oh, no, we're just halfway through the podcast, and you're gonna pass out. We can't. We don't have, We don't need this, Santi. Um, well, who else? Um, how are you getting lightheaded? I don't know. I'm gonna have to call. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna have to, like, just now, not, never before, never before with all of those times where you were doing the worst possible things to yourself and to us. You never felt lightheaded in those calls. But now, when we're having a casual conversation, it's because I'm on the spot. You're, I'm on the spot. You're gonna pass out. Oh god! About passing out. This is has nothing to do with anything, by the way. But during my um, graduation, because I recently graduated, everybody applaud for me. No, applaud for me now. No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, thank you. Thank you. All right. <clears throat> so um, I um, at my graduation, of course, my uh, my mentor was like, you know, giving every 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 Your mentor? student a little. Is that how you say it? I don't know how you say it in English. A uh, teacher. I, Hold on. God damn it. I hate the English language. All right. Mentor. Is I that, don't know how you say that. That's how we say it in Dutch. That's literally how you that's how you literally say it in you're English. A Jedi I don't, I don't Padawan. What's wrong? Okay, I guess that's not the right term. Fuck me, right? You know the dude that's okay, whatever. Um our teacher, whatever. Our teacher was um like giving every student a speech and stuff about us. He was done with me. He went off stage into the hallway where no one could see him. A guy comes out. He's like, yeah, so he just passed out. <laughs> and we were all just sitting there like, oh. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right. Shit. Is he, is like, <laughs> are you guys, like, doing anything about it? Are you taking care of him? It's like, like nope. I never spoke. <laughs> it's like, yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> Fuck that guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Knowing my school. Knowing my school. It's like. I don't know if he's uh, breathing to this day, but I'm sh I'm sure oh. he's fine. No, no, no. I'm, I'm like that was a joke. I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's just that my school is like god awful with like right, organization. All right. Anyways, VidCon. <laughs> <laughs> Let's um, go back to VidCon and hope you don't pass out. Oh, uh, what was it? Who else did I meet? I met Armored Skeptic, which was a great old time. He also agreed to be in the video, which is great. Uh, Shu was there. Um, they're all great fellows. <laughs> Um, just, just so that people know, shoe nice, not just a shoe. <sighs> I wasn't talking about shoe nice. No, shoe not shoe nice. Why did I say did shoe you, nice? I do mean, you uh, actually shoe on head? Do shoe you on know head. Who shoe on head. Nice is? <laughs> Why did I say shoe nice? Oh my god! For some, re <laughs> for some reason, I think if I met reason. shoe nice in person, I would like call the police. I. I <laughs> Oh I just realized god. who that is. Why did I say shoe nice? Oh my god. No. No, shoe, shoe on head. Shoe on head. Uh, she, she's a great person. Uh, 
I talked to her about gorillas for a little bit. Nice. Um, and, because uh, I happen to have a human shirt on, and, <laughs> um. It just so happened. So, what was, what was I saying? Um, yeah, so, I got armor skeptic in the video, and you guys are gonna see it. Um, it was a good time. Who else? Derek Blackman. Um. Who is, is also a content creator that I respect. And uh, I met a lot of other people. But the main men's, the main guys, are uh, the, the the epic guys. Um, Taz Lazuli was, uh, he was a great guy. He does... Um, it's funny because I, I have like, half of the people you're talking about I've never heard of in my life. Yeah, that's, you're a real <laughs> poo-poo head. <laughs> um, Taz Lazuli is a guy who does like... Um, instrumentals for videos that people can use, and I'm gonna start using his stuff. I'm actually gonna, I I don't know if I told you about him, but I'm gonna like s send you his stuff because he uses like jazz samples, and I really like that stuff. Oh, so like yeah. Oh oh okay. So like vlogger music. That's what I refer no, to. No no not not vlogger every... music. It's it's a uh, Leon Lush uses uh, uh, it. All and the time. I'm, I'm looking I'm looking it up now. I'm just gonna listen to it. Just just one of his during the podcast. Well. <laughs> I'm just listening to them. What, you think I'm gonna, like, shut up and listen to it? Like, oh, yeah, this is good shit. You can still talk to me, man. It's like <laughs> I be, so I can become a different entity when I start to listen to yeah. music. You, you don't? And, like, I, I try... <laughs> <laughs> shit, dude, I thought, I, th I thought you were with me here on this one. <laughs> you don't, like, transform when you listen to music? Dude! <laughs> shit, am I the only one? <laughs> uh, but, no, he was great, and, and he talked to me. Um, for a while, uh, we went to downtown Disney together. Um, uh, oh, I got to, I got to meet <coughs> James, uh, from, from the right opinion. Um, uh, not from the odd ones out, you little shithead. <laughs> uh, everyone got, everyone got excited for a second yeah. until we said the right opinion. I did meet uh, the odd ones out last year though. Um, but now he has... 8 million subscribers, so, you know, he's too special. <laughs> he's too special to be walking around like that. <laughs> he needs bot he needs bodyguards to just take the shot. Yeah. <laughs> so he, he, had a whole booth. So he had a whole booth for, for his merch, and it was so small, and they didn't expect so many people to line up to, to buy the merch. But anyways, James from The Right Opinion, he was a sweet fellow, and... Uh, and Rob Varan, which are uh, the Wooly one, um, and Grant from Grant's Rants were all very nice uh, people. Um, I think what was great is that like they didn't even like take into account that I was fourteen. Like they they were all like, oh no, yeah, that's what I that's what I th thought was like great. It's like because these it's are like, all people in like these 20s, are all right? Really great people who and. And uh, I guess they just judge me based on merits, um, which is pretty rare. Pretty, yeah. It's pretty rare, especially on the internet. So I actually appreciated that a lot. Um, they were great people, and I got to talk to them. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm, hap I'm, I'm waiting to see them next year. Um, if, uh, if any of them are listening to this, do you think <laughs> don't don't make the okay i'm pretty sure you are going to make everyone but the people you are meeting this to fucking incredibly uncomfortable <laughs> actually no i think you're just gonna make everyone uncomfortable <laughs> i think you just made me uncomfortable can we end the podcast <laughs> <laughs> i hate you <laughs> this is where the podcast ends we never right, uploaded julian um how about this i'm i'm getting lightheaded so um, I'm gonna go get some water. Um, all right. During the podcast, dude, what the hell? <laughs> just, just uh, talk to them about something random. Talk to the yeah, or we could just you know like cut it and post. All right, bye bye. <laughs> okay, whatever. Bye. I hope you trip and die. You didn't hear that. Everyone, uh, now that Beta Cult isn't listening, uh, unsubscribe to his channel, please. That was a joke. That was a joke. Um, but now that I'm alone here and uh, no one can uh, tell me what to do, I'm I can't. Uh, oh, wait, he's back. I'm back. Cool.
Cool. I'm back. Cool. I'm back. Okay. <laughs> and it's just silence for like another like, 20 minutes. Like for five minutes, just silence. <laughs> Continuing the podcast. Um, no, but you talk for a while, man. I talk for a while, yeah. You have been uh, talking. Actually, no, no, no. I need to finish. I need to finish the Tanaka. God damn it! All right, all right, all right. All right. Um, <clears throat> this is gonna be Santi talks and Julian listens to podcast. Yeah, dude. Like, <laughs> all right. I'll finish and then uh, you, yeah, you yeah. You talk. just, you just, and I'll talk about some, uh, some, some radical stuff <laughs> that a lot of people are gonna care about. <clears throat> uh, no, what was I gonna say? Um, yeah, so I went in and, uh, I went in like, uh, what am I saying? I went and ate some, <laughs> some good old Wendy's, uh, with, uh, with is the boys. Is your stuff actually, is our food, like, actually good? Oh, it's great. I love Wendy's. Really? Yeah. They, they make some good fries. Um, I went and ate some Wendy's and we were just talking about, like, why don't we just go to TanaCon? Because it was before yeah, the whole, we knew the whole disaster was going on. <laughs> uh, and some girls right next to us like at the table next to us were saying hey um it uh, it, it got done goofed <laughs> Tanakon Tana done goofed and um and we're like what do you mean and it was just like oh it's cancelled straight up and we're just like what the fuck <laughs> we go we just like we just oh. finished our food Went straight to Tanacon. We're like, we need to make a video. Because <laughs> um, we anticipated that this would be a huge topic. Um, but um, what ended up happening is we, we went to the scene and we interviewed some people. Uh, we saw a little bit of chaos happening. Uh, there was a security guard that told us that we couldn't go in. Um because the whole thing just got straight up canceled and we saw some people outside just screaming and <laughs> it was it was crazy we saw people uh holding just literal stacks of of Tanacon like badges and we were wondering like what even just happened here Jesus I'm not even joking like straight up stacks of badges <laughs> and <laughs> It was, it was you like, see like you see like people like like running away with them like it's like Black Friday just yeah that's how it was other. that's actually how it was mm. I wish I asked one of them for those because I'm pretty sure I, I wouldn't be surprised if they were like a collector's item now <laughs> like <laughs> it's like a staple to remember uh, of of the tragedy that yeah. was the cancellation of Tanic. <laughs> This will be a story for, like, centuries. Generation. It's going to be passed down to generation from generation. Um, but what was I going to say? Um, we interviewed some people on the street, and it was straight up, like, just a Twitter discussion happening right before us. Like, right before <laughs> our eyes. Um, and it was amazing. And we made a video, and it didn't get that many views. Fuck I've man. seen the video, though. You should watch... Uh, to anyone, um, watch... Listening to the podcast... Go watch the video. Watch the video right now. It's yeah! a good video. Watch it. Sonny, you're, you're not helping. <laughs> I feel like anyone who respected me as a person uh, at VidCon <laughs> is, is now just regretting that entirely. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, Jesus Christ. Who is this kid? It's like it's like they were all like really drunk, but they just didn't show it. And they wake <laughs> up and they look, at, they look at the footage like, who is this kid? <laughs> who was that? Hey, do you know who that is? <laughs> Dude, what? Uh, no idea. It's like, oh, no one knows. Um, but it was a disaster. Just hearing about everybody talking about him, like, wow, that's hilarious. <laughs> oh, my God. No, I need to talk about this. I don't know if I told you a whole meme with Keemstar that happened. Oh, my. It was, like, it was defending Tanacon. Yeah, no, so here's the thing. Um, So we tried giving the... We we're, like, when we when we made it, um, we were some of the first people to get, like, footage out of Tanacon. And, um... um <laughs> very, very charming. Um, just yeah, I know. Reminder. Please subscribe. <laughs> Please subscribe. Um, we tried... We were like, okay, so what can we do with this? Let's try giving it to Keemstar. 
And we're like, okay, so we could either ask him for money or a shout out. And we all agreed that a shout out would be infinitely more helpful in the long run. Um, because one shout out, and I was just ecstatic about a shout out from Keemstar. I was just like getting super excited. It was like one literal shout out from Keemstar on Twitter means the world to me. Yeah, dude, you're like, you're going viral, dude. Yeah, that would be just insane, right? Yeah. Um, Obviously, he won't give it to you because... um, And so, this is what... So, we we Twitter DM and we're like, okay, uh, do you want to, like, do you want to work something out? Uh, We have this footage of Tanacon, some stuff happening, uh, people on the street. This is really happening. And we actually told them about what was happening first. Or, Uh I, I think that's what happened. And then... He's like, oh, I don't want this footage. I'm not interested. <laughs> and we're like, wait, why? And then we <laughs> and then we see the episode that day that he puts out. He actually put out an interview with Tana Mong- Mo- Mojo, whatever his <laughs> fucking name is. Um, and, Tana uh, Mongoloid. Tana Mongolulu. <laughs> <laughs> um, and it was like an interview with her and she's just straight up like crying or not not crying that was Shane Dawson's video and she was just yeah. explaining what was going on she's like oh there were 20,000 people which there weren't by the way there were uh, there's no, there were like there were like yeah 4,000 or something there's 4,000 yeah. which is still a lot um over the capacity yeah, of the building it was, yeah um and you know <laughs> Keemstar because um because he's a biased piece of shit, he decided, oh, so, um, because I don't like VidCon, which should be entirely, you know, unrelated, because you're, yeah. you're Cause someone who, you're someone who, you know, you're a, delivers you're pretty the much news, the, you're, you're pretty much the, the news. news, he's like the news anchor of the internet, and you should be able to, like, See, okay, this is some footage of real stuff happening, and it's not great. All right. Maybe I should, like, use it. <laughs> let me just not use it because of let my not, own opinion. Let me just pass through this, like, god-awful uh, agenda that I have that VidCon is a bad thing. And, it, you know, it's, it's not even related, though. <laughs> like, you could just it's not, so, you could so not like VidCon and... Think that Tanacon is an awful idea, which it is. And so, I'm just there, and I'm like, literally, the only thing that stopped my channel from growing immensely is Keemstar's <laughs> dumb opinion, and I hated oh, that so much. Oh, oh I hated God, that so that's much. More, that's more reason to hate him. But oh still, my though. God. <laughs> oh, it's like it's like it's a curse. It's like it's a curse preventing you from getting anything <laughs> regarding regarding your YouTube channel. I know. <laughs> um, you finally you finally have like good footage, a, a, a chance. You know, there's no way you're not gonna blow up. It's like nah, I don't, I don't like VidCon. Nah. L- L- I'm gonna get my biased opinion in the way of the. It was, yeah. I mean, Just no like one there opinion. was. No one there was surprised, um, but no one there was also, like, happy about it, so it kind of sucked. But yeah, I mean, that's pretty much my whole story with VidCon. It was a great time. Uh, I'm really excited to meet these people again, and and, uh, yeah, Grace Motley, uh, just just letting you know, I'm not jealous of the views that you get, I'm just... Um, I am jealous, actually. I'm, I'm really jealous. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anyways, next topic. I'm going to lay back for a little bit because next topic. All right. All right. So, um, I'm looking at the sheet right now. Um, Julian's an active channel. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> um, I don't know how many people will care. About this, but this since this is going on my channel too, I'm, I, I guess it's worth addressing the uh, the insane inactivity for nine months. 
and what's been going on with literally everything um, I have promised to do. So, remember Flip's Void? That's a funny story. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty much summed up. Next topic. Um, <laughs> no, in actuality. Um, so, after tell, tell I made that... Tell the people that, who don't know who, what Flip's Void is. Okay, so... Um, if you don't know, what for the people on Betacol's channel that probably don't even give a shit about this in the first place, um, <laughs> Flip's Void was gonna be this this huge like project that was gonna do. It was gonna be this uh, animated series, um, well semi animated, and uh, it was gonna feature a bunch of my friends, including Betacol Television. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it, it was gonna have a whole storyline and everything, and it, it was gonna dedicate a lot of time to it. Problem was. I couldn't do that, because right after I made the update video, just a lot of stuff went down, uh, mostly regarding school and and the start of a new year, and it was the end, and it was just really busy because it was the last year, we were, like, constantly uh, working on, like, t- t- uh, tests and, 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 and Ah, uh, Julian, and I don't care, just make more videos! Fun stuff! Make more videos! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Shut up, you, you disgusting creature! I don't care! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Let me entertain you, damn it! All right, um, <laughs> make more. All right, so, so make more flash bit. Uh, that's patience, child. That is a, a topic that is about to be discussed. I don't um, know if you know this, but I don't have any semblance of patience whatsoever. <laughs> Can we just talk oh. about what like the process of of making oh, what this happened podcast? Before the podcast? Yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right. You know, okay, side, uh, let's just sidetrack again. Um, the process of, ta- of, of, about, of this podcast, right? This, like, um, this is like, well, how do you, how do you say that? Um, fucking just pre-podcast, right? Um, I'm like, Sandy just, just hits me up on Discord. It's like, okay, so are we actually doing it? Because we've been, we've been like, uh, procrastinating this whole concept. Procrastinating, yes. <laughs> Shut up, okay? This has been, like, an idea floating about for, like, months, okay? Yeah. I think since the start of this year. Yeah, it's we, just we been, been like, okay, are we doing... So Mostly because um, we were gonna have someone else as a host, too. And then, like, last minute, they decide to not do it. No, not even and last minute. It was... No, okay. it's not even... It, he was been thinking about this for a while. He just He just didn't say it. Yeah, he just didn't, he didn't tell us he didn't want to do it with us. And so that means that the whole time we could have done the podcast without him, but we were constantly waiting for him, whatever. Which so is great. That, that, <laughs> that pissed off Santi. I didn't care. Uh, I didn't oh, give I, a no, 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 shit. no, no, that pissed you off. That pissed you off. That, that didn't piss me off. It, al- it also pissed you off. I remember you g- being genuinely mad at Jake. I wasn't mad at Jake. I was mad at. I love how we. I love how we went out of the way not to name him, and we just name him. Why did I do that? All right. We, Wait. Uh, did were we supposed to not name him? Oh, I, I don't know. I w- I went out of the way to not name him. Just I don't. I don't anyone. care. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you, yeah. Okay, but what about him? Whatever. Whatever. Um, yeah, oh, but why it's just, would he care about being named? I don't know. <laughs> Jake, you suck. Jake, you're fat. Jake, suck my choke. Jake, please. I'm gonna All make right. another diss track. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. God. All right, we're getting sidetracked. Let me just back on track. Um, we got mad at him. Um, we hate him now. Yeah. <laughs> There's a whole drama going on. Ple- Keemstar, please. This is world news. Um, <laughs> world news. So like. We, we're like, Sandy's like constantly pushing me. Please, can we do it as soon as possible? I've been waiting a, 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 like this entire year. Can we please do it? Yeah. I'm like, okay. Um, we're going to do it originally. We were doing it, uh, was it yesterday? Yeah, right? Yeah. No, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Originally, we were going to do it yesterday. I couldn't do it because he just called me at a very inconvenient time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I pushed it to today. <laughs> What's End the, the inconvenience, just so they know? I want to... Shut up. <laughs> that is unimportant. It is important. Uh, it's not important. For telling um, the story. So, like... Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. God damn it. I love how, like, a fraction of the podcast is just talking about how, how much of a mess it is to organize the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so... I, I told Santi that 
I, I didn't have anything to do that day. I forgot that that day. Uh, lies. I was going, lies. I genuinely forgot. I forgot that I was going to my dad's house that day because, you know, my parents are divorced. Oh, boo-hoo. Who cares? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, boo-hoo. <laughs> okay, so I was going to my dad's house then, and I can't record the podcast at my dad's house because I have a literal laptop from, like, the Stone Age. So I can't do shit on that thing. AKA Sonny three years old. So- <laughs> Apparently three that is years still- old is no. unusable. Unusable. It, d- it is really bad, Sonny. It is this really bad. This computer is almost three years old. No, it's not. It's 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 almost two years old. Okay, whatever. So, um, like, Sonny keeps pushing me. It's like, oh, we can do it now. Just, we were like, because I was going to go in like 20 minutes. It's like, and we were in a call. And like, Sonny keeps pushing me. Come on, we can do it now. Ask for more time. I didn't do it partially just to piss him off because it was funny. Damn it. <laughs> I, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> but, like, it was also too much of a hassle because I had to pick up my brother up from... Because from, he was at a friend's house. I had to pick him up, too. Mm-hmm. It was too much of an inconvenience. So I was like, okay, I don't have anything to do tomorrow. We'll do it tomorrow, which is today. I expected you to call me at 3 for me because that's around the time when you called me yesterday. You didn't do that. So I was like, okay, whatever. It's like an hour before my little brother goes to bed because... Um, he lives at my dad's house, and whenever he goes to bed, I can't breathe. Otherwise, I get crucified. So, yeah. <laughs> so, shut up, would you? So it's like my. It's an hour before my little brother goes to sleep, and Sonny hits me up on Discord. Are we doing the podcast? I'm like, the podcast. God damn it! Shut up. It's like speaking English. I have to. Make an extra effort to speak English. You do know that, right? You do know no. it's not my native language. No, you're are you, American. Are you aware of that? You're American. <laughs> okay, so, <laughs> like, Sonny's like, are we doing the podcast? We have an hour. I'm like, shit. We're not going to be able to do it. I look at my room. There is no microphone to do the podcast with. I'm like, shit. I'm going to have to pick up the microphone from my mom's house and then do it here and, and rush it. And, and it's going to be shit. Um, I go to my mom's house and I'm like, wait, I like realize, why can't I just do it here right now? So I go back to my dad's house. And to grab here we all are today. My- <laughs> I go back to my dad's house <laughs> to grab all my shit. And Sonny, meanwhile, Sonny, the impatient fuck he is, he's just constantly pushing me. He's like, Julian, 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 he's like spamming me. <laughs> <laughs> it's like he's he bound a ma- he bound a macro to his Julian, mouse. your name's Flipyard. Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> he's like spam calls me. I'm I'm walking down the street. I hear the Discord ringtone. I'm freaking out. I'm like, God damn it, leave me alone. And here we are, um, recording this. This is this, 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 this great. This just just piece of shit of a podcast. God damn it. Anyways, um, all right, so yeah, that's the thing with Julie's channel. My channel is also extremely inactive. Um, What's the thing with my channel? I well, feel like I got sidetracked like, so much. I forgot that it's what I was talking about. Well, yeah, no doy. And that you haven't made any content because you're fat. But but I'm just gonna shine a very dim light of hope. Um, I am currently working. On stuff for my channel. Ooh. I'm currently working on on a script for a new video, so please tell me you're doing another update video, please, please, Julian. I I'm actually done. You know, like I'm <laughs> probably gonna just can we just end the podcast right here right now? Why? <laughs> I don't I don't even hear Julian anymore. <laughs> I'm back! Hey! <laughs> My microphone got unplugged. Okay. <laughs> don't worry, I'll fix all of this in post. Don't even fret. Don't right. don't worry about it. Anyways. Anyways, that was this uh that was the the beta cool talks and flip yard. No, says two it's things. not! <laughs> it's not over! It's not over? We've been recording for an hour. We can fit in a, l- a little extra bit. A little extra? Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Like? Yeah. 
Well, as I was saying, as I was saying, um, I have plans in store for my channel. Please look forward to that. Um, if you're if if you're uh, one of Beta Cole's, uh people listening to this, uh, subscribe to my channel right now. Please do it. Do it. Unsubscribe from Beta Cole. That would be also greatly appreciated. No, subscribe no, to my no, channel. No. Road to 10K, guys. Come on. No. No. Okay. If you're, uh, however, if you're one of my listeners, please go and report Beta Cole's channel. I'm just kidding. All right, guys. So, to, so um, right now, I'm going to ask a few things because apparently <clears throat> Julian wants the podcast to end, which is very um, uncool of him. We've been recording for an hour. I, I don't see why we can't end. I don't care. Um, but I wanted just to add some unplanned surprises. Um. Uh, we will be giving away a Lego bird, baby! Hey! hey! I have lots of Lego birds. Yes! <laughs> I'm dude. not even yes. joking. I have many. I have like five. Yes! I have five Lego Please. birds. So, uh, if you want a Lego bird, all you have to do is like this video, uh, share it with your peers, and, um, please give us your new firstborn. Actually, no, we'll come up with something. I, let's come up with something else, because that's gay. Let's you want to make an actual giveaway? Let's, yes, let's do it. Let's do it. I mean, I'm not so even. An actual I'm not even joking about the Lego bird. <laughs> you want to give away a Lego? bird? Do you bird? understand how many Lego birds I have? So, us, uh, back me up. He has a lot. <laughs> I have a lot of Lego birds. <laughs> okay. Too many. Thanks for the. I don't. Concrete proof. I don't really so, want any. More. Do you want to? Do you want to give away an amiibo? Hell no. No amiibos. <laughs> no amiibos. Those are mine. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. So what do they have what do the fans have to do to earn the Lego bird? Alright, alright, alright. Hmm. It has to be something creative. I want it to be something creative, because if it's that dumbass shit where you like the video and subscribe nah 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 nah. You can do that too, but like no. No. If you want this bird, you gotta you gotta write a song. You gotta write a song. <laughs> write a song. We're gonna write a song, write a song about need this. You, and uh, we will sing it on the next podcast. But it's gotta be good. It's gotta be good. We're very, we're very, um, we are uh, connoisseurs we're when it comes to extremely uh, elitist when it comes to songwriting. <laughs> yes, we're, okay, so we need you to just go all out on it and we will sing it. On the next podcast. On the end of the next podcast. Well, I, I, I didn't think that was going to be the thing. I thought that they would write a song. Well, we're doing it anyway, so screw you. All right, and it doesn't have to be, like, like very good quality. Wait, what if no one does it, though? <laughs> that's a, It's so sad because that's a genuine fear we have because, oh, my God. I'm sure someone will do it. Someone will do it. Someone, someone has to do it. Remember, this, this episode's going up on my channel. And you know, so I hope I, I'm sure someone will do I'm it. Not, if we're you not want a beautiful for anything like high quality, we're just asking for the best one. No, so like, what what do they have to do? Do they have to sing? Uh, give us the lyrics or genuinely oh, actually, sing the song? Actually, no, no, no. All right, let's. Okay, so it has to be about Flipyard's dying channel. God damn it! Make a song about Flipyard's dying channel. Make a diss track about my dying channel. No, well, we actually, go. it doesn't have to be. It can be a, a, any genre, doesn't matter, okay? We're not putting too many oh. limitations. And you have to all be right, within right. the United States. Because <laughs> there goes away <laughs> 90% of our viewers. Epa! 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 <laughs> um, I don't know how many I'm people. I'm totally fine with giving United. away this Lego bird because I, I really don't care. <laughs> um, so so you, can't, you can't ship it overseas? Or is that is it just cost too much, it's or is it literally not possible? I mean, Damn. I mean, I don't, I don't know, dude. <laughs> um, all right, all right. Hey, well, if you're in the if you're in the Bay Area, I could probably give it to you uh, manually. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, you'll come over to their house, no, like hey, they'll beat up? you Here to you death. Like, <laughs> <laughs> um, all right. You can meet a uh, meet and greet, and the other, but it's and only the other you. Thing, if anyone is still here. Um, any questions in the podcast? I think this will just be a thing, like a constant thing that we'll do for every single yeah. podcast. Um, we'll have a Q&A segment and we will answer every and any question. 
Yeah, that's a good idea. That's no, a good no. idea. Because it's like we're not big at all. So it's like not going to be too much of a time thing. <laughs> yeah. If we answer every single question. <laughs> um, so, all right. Um, any, anything else? Thank you for uh, listening to the beta cast. I hate you. I it hate was... all of you. I hate it. I hate you all. If if remember, if you uh like to inhale oxygen and exhale carbon dioxide, please consider subscribing to both of our channels. Also preferably um, mine. Also Thank subscribe you. to Vlogger Joe. Don't do that. Please don't do that. Hey yeah, uh, thanks for listening to our podcast. If you enjoyed it, consider subscribing to Beticle's channel, as future episodes will be released on there. Goodbye.